Comté or Gruyère de Comté, French pronunciation K T, is a French cheese made from unpasteurized cow's milk in the Francia Comté traditional province of eastern France. Comté has the highest production of all French AOC cheeses at around 64,000 tons annually. The cheese is made in discs, each between 40 cm (16 in) and 70 cm (28 in) in diameter and around 10 cm (4 in) in height. Each disc weighs up to 50 kilograms, 110 pounds, with an FDM around 45%. The rind is usually a dusty brown color, and the internal pate is a pale creamy yellow. The texture is relatively hard and flexible, and the taste is mild and slightly sweet. Topic: <laughs> Production. Fresh from the farm, milk is poured into large copper vats where it is gently warmed. Each cheese requires up to 600 liters US gal of milk. Rennet is added, causing the milk to coagulate. The curds are then cut into tiny white grains that are the size of rice or wheat which are then stirred before being heated again for around 30 minutes. The contents are then placed into molds and the whey is pressed out. After several hours the mold is opened and left to mature in cellars, first for a few weeks at the dairy, and then over several months elsewhere. The manufacture of Comté has been controlled by AOC regulations since it became one of the first cheeses to receive AOC recognition in 1958, with full regulations introduced in 1976. The AOC regulations for Comté prescribe Only milk from Montbelliard or French Simmental cows or cross -breeds of the two is permitted. There must be no more than 1.3 cows per hectare of pasture. Fertilization of pasture is limited, and cows may only be fed fresh, natural feed, with no silage. The milk must be transported to the site of production immediately after milking. Renneting must be carried out within a stipulated time after milking, according to the storage temperature of the milk. The milk must be used raw. Only one heating of the milk may occur, and that must be during renneting. The milk may be heated up to 56 C, 133 F. Salt may only be applied directly to the surface of the cheese. A casein label containing the date of production must be attached to the side of the cheese, and maturing must continue for at least four months. No grated cheese could be sold under the Comté name between 1979 and 2007. In 2005, the French government registered 175 producers and 188 affinors agers in France. Topic grading each cheese is awarded a score out of 20 by inspectors according to overall appearance up 1 point, quality of rind 1.5, internal appearance 3.5, texture 5, and taste 9. Those scoring greater than 15 points, called Comté Extra, are given a green casein label with the recognizable logo of a green bell. Those cheeses scoring 12 to 14 points are given a brown label and are simply called Comté see picture with different labels. Any cheese scoring 1 to 2 points out of a possible 9 for taste, or Jury <inaudible> terroir <inaudible> Comté is well known for its distinct terroir. The term, terroir, refers to a particular smell and taste that is derived from the immediate local environment and its traditional methods of production. Therefore, no two wheels of Comté taste alike. Its terroir has several causative factors including, having been made in 160 village-based fruitières cheese-making facilities in their specific region, owned by farmers who bring their own milk from their cows, strict production rules linking between place and product, and the seasonal environmental effects. Because of its uniqueness and unfamiliarity, Comté cheeses go through the process of jury terroir. Where panels of trained volunteer tasters from Comté supply chain and from the region discuss and publish bi-monthly in the newsletter Les Nouvelles de Comté about the taste and their results. This jury terroir was created by Florence Barodier, the food scientist, to elaborate in response to a set of formidable challenges that Comté cheese underwent in the beginning for its unfamiliar taste and smell. The jury terroir is there to speak of all the richness in the tastes of a Comté. Original member confirmed. For Comté cheese to be worldly renowned, the quality improved, but the challenge stands still to create a uniform taste, which was impossible to achieve since there were 160 different fruitières specializing. 
but through the process of jury terroir, people came to focus on communication among the tasters, which improved their ability to perceive and gained in value. They acquired a general culture that enabled to describe and exchange about the taste of comtesse. 